my name is Evelina and I'm gonna be taking over the Pop Sugar channel from time to time because I'm gonna be doing some awesome fashion DIYs. And today I'm gonna to show you a really fun DIY. I don't know if you guys know this, but I am 50% Russian and I was born in Russia, so why not do a matryoshka costume or how else you would call it, a nesting Russian doll. And right here I have one of them. I brought it with me from home and super awesome. So I'm gonna show you this costume. is super simple, really cheap. Uh, it might take you anywhere from 30 minutes to two hours, depending on how detailed you wanna paint it. And you're definitely gonna turn heads because it's something super unique and you get extra cool points from the Russians. So you're gonna need some paints, brushes, possibly Mod Podge if you're feeling extra crazy, an X-Acto knife and a ribbon. So here I'm using a 18 by 24 uh, Bristol paper that you can buy at any craft store and I'm just basically outlining the shape of the matryoshka which kind of looks like a squished bowling pin. And then here I sort of made this little shape that fit around my face. I cut it out and used it as a stencil to make sure that when I cut this out it's going to fit around my face. So now I'm just going to draw in the details and I really just looked at a couple of these online and kind of combined my favorite parts and made my own design for the doll and you can definitely be as creative as you want or you can just copy pretty much exactly what I made so you don't have to think of many designs but um, yeah I draw a little apron and then she has a braid she's a Russian beauty um, and then some flowers of course what matryoshkas don't have a flower on them uh, so then I'm just gonna take my paints and color everything in and as you can see some of the flowers or the certain detailing are gonna have this sort of a one-stroke effect to them like kind of the brush has strokes what I'm doing is I'm dipping uh, the brush into several colors of paint to create that kind of gradient effect I guess it, and it's like the easiest way of doing it so I'm just basically filling everything in and it's actually quite therapeutic I was watching my favorite show and doing this and you can add little details I'm just adding some dots on the sides and this is the probably the most fun that I've had is drawing the flowers so I just did like a base and then I added a little bit of a darker paint and I uh, sort of feathered it in and then added some white in the middle to like give it a little bit of a gradient nice feathery effect I think it looks totally cool it almost looks like a real matryoshka I think um, another thing that you can do once you're done with this is cover the whole thing with Mod Podge to give it that really nice glossy look but I just kind of skipped that step so here I'm just gonna cut out the oval shape of the matryoshka using a cutting board or anything like that and then to make sure that you can tie it around your neck just glue down two ribbons or you can tape them down and for the hair I am just going to kind of brush it really nicely make sure that you part it right down the middle it's actually like a Russian thing to do I guess um, it's just that's what people used to do they had their hair part in the middle so the only thing that I'm really doing to my makeup is gluing some lower lashes and really over exaggerating my blush plus Plus, of course, do the red lip. And uh, that's it. Really pretty easy. Just take it, put it around your head, tie it down, and you are done. Be prepared to turn lots of heads. And it's actually not the most comfortable costume, but you will definitely have the entrance to the party. up I have a question for you guys let me know what you're gonna be for Halloween this year because I want to know please tune in for new episodes of this whatever this is every month from me on this channel don't forget to subscribe and also check out my channel if you haven't checked it out yet the links are all there just saying thank you so much for watching I will see you very soon bye guys